The deal is the bees are in the wall, so he has to uh, spray something into that little area. And the hive actually isn't down in there because that's what I asked. I thought, you know, is the hive weighed it back in there? But Kevin says, no, it's actually in the wall. And the queen bee wow. found kind of a, the queen bee found like a little you know, a little opening in the wall. She oh, made her way in, and then nice. all of the other bees followed suit. Okay. And he said, he said we're going to see some bees as uh, as he sprays, sprays in. It's moving today. This casual fun run takes place every Monday in downtown Phoenix, absolutely free. That's my price. Our Jamie Serretta is live at Cityscape to tell us what it's all about. Good morning, Jamie. Hey guys. You know, I know Scott is a workout fiend, but I don't know about you. Facebook or something. <laughs> what, you all mumpy and everything? <laughs> no, I don't want that. But I will say this. A big old long ear lobe. Uh, or, uh, know, as a boy, eye sealed shut. this is our dream to yeah. get in and mix yeah. it up with a beehive. Um, is he, he, so he's putting uh, some sort of they look, agent <laughs> They're getting rambunctious, yeah, they're it looks starting like. starting to come out. Right, you see some, there are actually a few more bees out now. Yeah, he's in there spraying this agent in there, and it's going to kind of put these put these guys to sleep so they can figure out a way to remove that beehive. Deal is, is that he says it doesn't take too much time, but they probably have a hive in there. They have oh, some honeycomb. You know, they have honey probably inside the wall as well. It's like the Ritz and, Carlton uh, for them. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> on the Ritz Carlton. Living in a closet on Living, North, Yeah, with honeycomb. I mean, come on. They're wow. not so leaving. we're going to. So what happens when the bees uh, all fall asleep, Celeste? Then you have to rip out the wall of the closet and it sounds That's like exactly a terrible what I asked. job. Yeah. Oh my goodness. So this is the deal. After they take care of this situation, mm -hmm. they, they're going to have to have somebody go into the home, open up that wall, oh. just rip out that honeycomb, oh. you know, oh clean out all that stuff. Yeah. They're going to, wow. this is How'd a How'd you like to be at the job. drywall company? I think that's the new guy getting that job. <laughs> right. Hey, Rusty, come over here a second. Okay, yeah, we're going to Okay, so they're here. starting to come out now. Here they go. Kevin kind of gave us the... Uh, the heads up and he said you know you see some a lot of the bees starting to come out okay. now all right all right well, well they you, don't look happy that's for no. sure no. Celeste. okay be careful keep working we're getting the wrap so we have to go although i could watch this all morning long yeah. i want to see him come oh. out yeah they, no kidding they're okay. going to be busy bees out here guys yes you ah, are I knew that was coming. <laughs> all they, the pun intended they don't look happy but they know not to attack the beekeeper when right. they come out so they'll look for other you know <laughs> target of opportunity <laughs> right uh, those are the three downtown parks that we will take people Oh, that Christian. stings. Come on. <laughs> I'm buzzing about something else. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Come on, honey. <laughs> no, seriously, I could have watched that all day, too. I was right? like, oh, my gosh. I First of all, Celeste in the suit. I she mean, that's good. that's good TV right there. <laughs> yeah, she didn't have to say anything. Uh, okay, so there's this love story, you guys, that is just too crazy to be a coincidence store and you want to kick it off you want to start running yeah, with me yeah sure well, we'll why not uh, yeah. yeah let's do it okay Whoa. <laughs> and off they go look at that yeah just what he thought he was gonna i'll wear well, my suit so i can sure. go today well and i'm with jamie i need a little extra motivation uh, i've got yeah. my little fitbit here that i just i took off oh, for looks yeah. but i gotta keep track of my steps otherwise i might be sitting and laying down you think all that's day long. you think that's accurate i don't know anything will help there you go. All right, Bruce Hafner up over Piastawa Peak with something really important this morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks a lot. Uh, let me give you a... Actually, is her husband. So no, they didn't know way. each other. They had no idea. And then... Just the photo oh, you know what? Yeah. I, I saw for a second. With the glasses. That was him? Okay, that was her husband. So 16 years after this home video was shot with her family, uh, they met in their neighborhood in New Jersey. No way. Star started dating. Three years after that, they got married. That's crazy. And so they were watching this video, and he's like, no way. So he's their like, families that's were... Me. That's me. Their families were Jeez. at Disneyland at the same time. Wow. wow. So, crazy! And um, I think I'm going to come over with you guys on the couch okay. to chat or whatever. But yeah, yeah this is going around uh, today. That's pretty crazy. Uh-huh. All I right. Know. I was... uh, well, um, happening today, it is the 12th anniversary of the death of Lori Paestawa. And this morning, lots of people are gathering to honor her memory. Yeah. It's, so you probably know Lori's story by now. She was a soldier from uh, Tuba City. Uh, she was with the uh, 507th Maintenance Company of the U.S. Army. It was killed uh, in a, an attack an ambush really uh, this day uh, in 2003 in Iraq her uh, uh, grab this sales event get great offers on your
on the roadway for all the extra bikers this week across our beautiful state. For the kiddos headed out the door to the bus stop this morning, well, temperatures are in the 50s right now. We expect that we'll be around 60 degrees by 8 o'clock, a mild start to your day. It's 36 in Flagstaff. 47 right now in Kingman and 63 at Lake Havasu, 54 in Tucson and 52 right now in Globe. Mostly clear skies show low, waking up to 45 degrees and it's 45 in Payson as well. Satellite and radar across the southwest shows some cloud cover that moved through overnight. Kept our overnight temperatures a little bit more mild tonight into tomorrow morning. They're expected to be a couple degrees cooler as we'll see some clearing this afternoon. That's going to mean lots of sunshine for your Monday afternoon and really warm temperatures for this time of year. Typically the valley this last week of March is hovering right around 79, 80 degrees. Instead, we're going to be near 86 today in Gilbert and Mesa, 87 in AJ and Queen Creek, and 85 today in Fountain Hills, 86 for Scottsdale and 87 for Tempe, 85 today in Moon Valley, 82 at Anthem and 86 in downtown Phoenix, 89 in Ahwatukee. Warming up quickly, 87 for Sun City, Peoria and Glendale. In fact, 87 all across the West Valley for your Monday. 86 is your official forecast high all the way through Wednesday. The only real change we're looking at the next couple of days are some uh, cloud cover, uh, a little bit of cloud cover that's going to move in by Tuesday and a little bit more on Wednesday. Still, we've got no rain, just dry and warm weather. In fact, we're probably going to be in the mid 90s by the weekend. Stick around. We've got much more Good Morning Arizona coming your way. Mentos. No digas nada más. Tú estás equivocado. Yo sí. estoy correcto. Daniel Inerio, ¿qué creen? A conferencias, eventos de tu campo para conocer gente. No hay nadie que pueda quitar. Ah, bueno. Exacto. Y Daniel y Juliet se, se reconcilian. Si sí, yo me no. no. Si la vida te presenta más de una oportunidad. Bueno. En este caso, si me la presentas. Seguimos no? luego. Nos encanta vivir bien. Innovation. To spend on board, plus a 50% reduced. So many millions. Try some. Mm. Just ahead on GMA, new details on the Robert Durst case. Why you know Amazon Prime is... One helps keep you awake. The other helps you sleep. Prime is tens of thousands of your favorite movies and TV episodes streaming instantly. What were you going to tell me that? Prime is access to more than a million... Oh, maybe that's what's preventing me from getting the sleep I need. Talk to your doctor about ways to manage your insomnia. Trial now. And SRX for three fifty nine per month. And make sure you. Escena. Uno de los agentes del orden. Mira, sube las redes sociales. Mira, 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 mira. CBS Five exposes the un. Bruce up in the penguin air of the sun coming up. We showed you how easy it in Yemen because of continued civil you're actually putting their life touch your skin to release fragrance up to 12 hours new caress love forever for an unforgettable fragrance up to 12 hours I want regularity so call Amika today for auto home or life no tripulados, conocidos como drones. Mientras tanto, la tienda en línea Amazon ya tiene planeado. Con todos los detalles de esto y más aquí. Taste free and dissolved. Questions were raised over the woman's. I think, yeah, I like the brakes on 95, just for a little longer. Yeah, that'd be fine. Yeah. It's too much. Mm -hmm. Wait, I'm blaming myself now. Yeah. Well, I mean, well, no. Good morning, everyone. Time right now is 726. We have some new information this morning about a deadly shooting that happened late last night. I'm Emma Jade. And I'm Faye Fredericks. The scene in a neighborhood near 51st Avenue in Cactus. This old house is like... Started fighting in a car. That son pulled out a knife. According to police, she fell out of the car. He kept stabbing her. Several people tried to help her out. One of them went inside his home, came back with a gun, told the son to stop. And when he didn't, he fired. Police say the son died from that shooting. They also say the woman who was stabbed was taken to the hospital in critical condition. We're going to have more details on this story on 12news.com. Happening this morning, a judge is expected to officially dismiss...
It's been a busy one out there as far as slowing goes. US 60 on the westbound side getting closer to rural. We did have a bad crash that was blocking most of the lanes. It's now been pushed off to the right so you can still exit there. But you're going to see a lot of red trailing as you're getting closer to that spot. So just either be patient or take any of the streets running parallel to US 60 and hop on after rural. 27. But first, let me give you a quick live look from our ADAR camera on the 51 northbound at McDowell. You can see traffic is flowing really good, so that's good news. Now, the areas affected are listed right here on your screen. We're told crews southbound at the 10. It's moved to the side. It is causing a tad bit slowing before you get to that area, but nothing major. And then the other one that is causing a lot of slowing for you is on the 60 westbound at Rule. The right lane is blocked, but you have a lot of red there, which means you guys are going to be going about 25 miles an hour. So be aware of that if you're heading on the 60 in that direction westbound. I will keep you updated. Everything else changes, but right now we need to see if the... ...would Walmart on Saturday, police saying that one of the suspects assaulted an employee there. Here in contrast to what's happening... It's going to be a nice uh, morning to head outside and get some exercise in the 60s, 87 degrees as we head through the afternoon. With moving uh, torn off uh, inside. <laughs> he's, he wrong? sort of sounds like he's in anguish. Yes. Wow, you two are really it sounds like this song. Like love is too much for him. Cobb, innovation that excites. <laughs> Welcome back to Good Morning Arizona. It's 7.30 on this Monday morning. I want to take you outside this morning. We've got a beautiful morning going on. Right. <laughs> Let the females alone and focus on your career for a while, Nick Jonas. <laughs> you Hope you're listening. <laughs> That's uh, unseasonably warm weather is going to last. Coming. <laughs> out there. A quick update on this accident at the U.S. 60. Hey, the Valley woman who spent more than 20 years. So do expect some long delays as traffic is backed up to Mesa Drive. That's about three miles. Our top story here at 730 on this Monday.